All right, welcome everyone, Resemblance of Sanity. I'm Caleb. I'm Jacob. And we're here for Kaiji, Kaiji Season 2, Episode 13. Heist right. time, baby! Yep, Ichijo versus Kaiji. Versus Kaiji, and yeah, one man. of them is outclassed. One of them is outclassed somewhat. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But Ichijo had everything prepped for that day. He did. Yep. It's not just the pins. It's not just oh, yeah. the block. It's down to the fucking balls, man. Mm -hmm. Yep. He, he, He's got them by the balls, man. got them man. by the balls. This man has brass balls. Mm -hmm. Well, yeah, but... Kaiji, now he's the one initiating, and in a way that they probably really won't expect. So yeah, he's about to trip all land. over them balls. Mm -hmm. uh, but yeah, Kotaro, we're gonna need you to fall in line with Kaiji here. Yes, if you want to have any hope of mm -hmm. this whole thing working out. Yep. And Kaiji, we need you to also be uh, very shrewd and cold with regards to this plan here. Yep. Because Kotaro has kind of shown his his limitations. Exactly. And while he is very, like, sold in on the idea that he's got to win this, which is good, mm -hmm. meaning he won't betray you here. Right. Like, no way in yeah, hell now he ever he's betray dependent you. on you. But yeah. it's the, still the thing of where you still limit what he's actually, you know, yep. uh, Maybe able to give. Maybe really, truly use him as your canary at this point. Yeah. Yeah. But y'all, without further ado, let's get into this. Oh. He had a drunken rage and just that. Oh or... no! Maybe the maybe the casino people came for him and just. Oh, fuck! No, I think, yeah, yeah. Kaiji kun, Gorimuchi, Yeah. Kujo Rakujitsu, Yudan Taiteki. Oh, fuck. Yep. So is he just going to gamble the rest of his money away, or like... Or is he going to go that seems steal like more money from oh. the safe? Oh. Gotcha. Ow! Shit! Oh. Wait. If he figured out what was inside it, and then he uses that as a way to try and fuck with the sensor. Holy shit, what is he cooking then? Like... And we aren't getting to see what it is! Mm -hmm. yeah. But I mean, hey, you're doing great. Yeah, he barely has, like, yeah, a little less than a, uh... Yeah, a little over, over a, week. a week. Okay, yeah. yeah, so that's actually not that great, but... Right. Cool. Damn, alright. Respect. Adding more. Yep. Mm -hmm. さあ、向かいのビル立って大分経つよね。彼これ1年かな。まだ工事終わらないんだ。うん。それがさ、これだ。思いもしない情報を得る。早速会議はそのことを工事関係者に確かめる。ああ、そうだよ。よし。What? What? Yeah. God, so many pieces are being set up, but we don't know what they are, which means it's good. But they're gonna work, but don't believe in the lie of luck, Kaiji. Oh, someone else is doing that. Yeah. If I break down all the walls over there, will we finally be free? Yeah, yeah, uh huh. Yeah, what are you doing here, man? Are you sure? Yeah. Oh, this guy's like, yeah, yeah. 
あんたが手離さなきゃだからあんたが<笑>いいんですか yeah, yeah, you're absolutely yeah, sure yeah, yeah. Oh, this guy's like Hey, bro, we don't want to take your money if you're on like drugs or you're insane here Holy shit Oh Alright それ手つけちゃいけないかねなんで。ああ。してください。何を言う。これはわしの。金庫から崩れてきた金だろうが。おう。バカ。何を言う。そういうわけなんで。ナイス、ナイス。カムウィズミーイフユワンナナゲットア
Holy shit. What's my cut? Yeah. Rules, here we go. Sarani こっちが人手用意するならその人件費及び人材調達の手間賃としてお前が今日俺から借りる金は千万だ。なお、お前が指定した勝負日、六日後まで一日三割の福利で増えていくとなる。Fuck。こうなる。四千八百二十六万八千
Is the if I lose, I'm just going back down into hell. That's, right. That's fine. Is the desperation because he doesn't want to go back there? Is that more for him versus the people who know they're not in there yet? Right. But they, they could, could be. be. Yeah, you know, yeah. so... That's where Endo's at, for sure. Yep. Because he doesn't know what how far the pit can fall down below. Exactly. And Kaiji knows that there's something even worse below hell. Mm -hmm. You know, so hell has nine layers, you know? Yeah, they, so. they, they didn't harvest your organs. No. You no, know, no. So, yeah. But, okay, okay. Uh -huh. Kaiji's got a thing with construction yep. that we haven't been told about, which we, means we know it's going to work. Mm -hmm. It's going to be something that's going to tie into the past stuff with Kotaro uh, Sakazi, Sakazaki, but and then the, Endo is going to be the one financing them and giving them a team of guys that'll be able yep. to do some stuff there. That's also good because uh -huh. while those guys are going to be involved in this, they will not be the ones getting a cut right. from they're the thing there. They're just doing a construction they're job. They're just maybe, getting paid money to do a thing. So and they're they're maybe not, do it under the table, you know. Right, right, right. Yeah. They, they're not afraid to get their, their hands dirty. So yep. that's all very safe as far as things go here. Uh -huh. So right now, the fact that they're all getting paid out an equal $200 million uh -huh. from the actual payout, yep. which is incredibly yeah. stupid large amounts of money. Oh, yes. We are now in it. I don't think any of them will betray each other yeah. now. This is a true triumvirate, an axis of, yeah. of, because, uh, of desperate power. Here. Because I like the Endo, while the interest that he's charging is criminal. Lone shark. Yeah, 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 yeah. exactly. Um, given that he had to borrow some of it from a lone shark himself, it's like, hey. Cut him some slack Cut here. him some slack. <laughs> yeah. But then also it's the, he wants that payout. And if this doesn't he work, he doesn't get that the payout. payout. Yeah. So, you know, so it's the, yeah, and that'll come off the top, you know, from the winnings. Cool. Mm -hmm. Makes sense. Yep. And yeah. then and then they split the rest evenly. Love Fuck. it. Can you imagine being Endo uh -huh. and Kaiji comes to you with a deal and yeah. you're like, wait, I heard what Fuck. happened. Yeah. No. no oh, oh no. sure. It's the idea of like, what are How you are you here? Of? Yeah. How? It's yeah. the idea that. Yeah. He Ultimate actually survivor. believes yeah. he actually believes in Kaiji so much that he gave him 50-50 odds. Yeah. Like Yeah, that's, that's crazy. That's insane. That's that is like, actually insane. Kaiji is defying all odds just by being there for Endo. So it's almost like this 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 mm -hmm. this it's it's it's, yeah. it's 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 kind of like Gollum, if you will. Gollum yeah. somehow had the ring for five hundred years and never succumbed to pure, pure madness. He right. still held on to that slight sliver of his identity. Yeah. Kaiji yeah has yeah. been to well, hell and back well, and, and, and is somehow still fighting like right y yes yeah ultimate survivor y yeah yeah mm -hmm. absolutely mm -hmm. like earns the title absolutely earns the title and i cannot wait this this just even more so compounds huh, um <laughs> the desire that i have Your to interest? see well yeah <laughs> oh my god it compounds my interest in seeing kyodo see kaiji and know that like wait Endo works for you now? Like, he, uh, probably, he probably doesn't even know who Endo is. Actually, now that I think no, about it. No, he doesn't give a fuck about it. No, no. Endo is nobody. <laughs> no. Uh, Tonegawa probably didn't even really know who Endo is. Maybe, no. maybe. Maybe, maybe. Maybe you'd heard the name. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Probably never know. even seen right. him, yeah. But the idea that Kaiji comes back and it's not just him, but, like, he actually has a team, you know? Like, I mean, that's that's the ultimate, like, end yeah. goal for Kaiji is that he slowly builds his own team. Oh, yeah. Yeah, and like, while... you know the 45ers, if, like, if he if he makes it work and they get out, yeah. Especially since they got here because of their own like you know probably addictions and things mm -hmm. like that, they are absolutely gonna want to still stay hitched to Kaiji with regards to like, hey, if you need anything from me, let's do this because they yeah. don't want to fall back into their old habits either. And so, yeah, I this is a legend that's being born here. Right. It's a it's a very scary thing mm -hmm. because <coughs> <coughs> the biggest thing we can always count on with Kaiji, for the most part, is that he's a pretty genuine guy for the yeah. most part mm -hmm. but in this mire and muck and fighting these demons and you know going through hell and all that he could become something monstrous in the long 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 oh. haul but mm. the story is not going anywhere close to no. that obviously anytime soon but it's the kind of thing where when you think about what kaiji is doing and what he's building here it is something like revolutionary in that yeah. regard. And that's oh, yeah. kind of what he symbolizes in that regard. But yep. but in the story here, he's not capable of wielding that much power at any given point. Nope. So he has to bring in other people, yeah. which then shows <laughs> the revolutionary aspect where it becomes a great leader. Uh -huh. But I love that every arc that he showcases his qualities as a leader he gets a little bit better. He yeah. gets a little bit more adept at running uh -huh. things. He gets oh, a yeah. little bit more confident. He gets a yep. little bit more power. And it's something where we are not seeing his meteoric rise. We are seeing him 
break his fingernails yes. to claw his way up, uh -huh. and then climb back up again with the nubs of his fingers that are fingernailless as yeah. he, you know, yeah. scrapes them down to the bone. And it's 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 impressive. It's impressive. It's it's, it's damn impressive. And then the anime just does a really good job as all you know, anime do a the visually dramatic, selling you know, us on yeah. the, the story uh -huh. itself. So oh, absolutely. Really the, fun stuff. Yeah. Um I loved the play of also calling uh Kotaro with the hey you stole this from the safe. Right. And then me and people go, wait, what? And he's like, well, sh sh shut the fuck up, you know? Yeah. And it's like, nope, that's my play to be like, I get the money. And the yep. people are like, yeah, we don't right. want to deal with anything criminal here. Anything criminal, but also with the way that Kaiji said it and him going to confront him, mm -hmm. that could be the, we were business partners and you stole that from me. Right. You right. know, right. Like, like there's all kinds of things that it could be yeah. besides the, the police need to get involved and arrest both of these people. Right, you know? right, yeah. So it's it's the kind of thing where I I really like the way the the average Joe non named characters in this story react to the things that mm -hmm. they're doing and stuff. Yep. And then now that we have each Joe kind of being aware, like okay, he's cooking, so install more hidden cameras. Mm -hmm. We're going to be ready. He's yep. going to come back eventually. We know he has a deadline. Right. We know that. We can expect him in the next five days or so. Yeah, exactly. Because like, we, we know... Kaiji ha needs to win so big, and he's committed himself so much, just in time-wise, right. to this venture that he can't... He, he dropped can't, the card. Like he, he, well, right, but no, but he, he, burned can't, his ships. he can't change directions. He can't try a different tactic of I'll win somewhere else. He has well, to win here. Well, that's what Ichijo is trying to get him to do, is basically right. say, yeah, go try some other casino. I'll make it easier for yeah. you. Or even some of the other stuff in this casino. You know, just not this. Yeah, 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 but 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 by yeah. tearing up the card, he was basically saying, "No, I'm going to steal this from you, mm -hmm. and you're going to be the one that's you know yep. on a puddle of of, of oh, yeah. piss and you, tears and on the, or, on the on or the maybe floor. you'll need to apologize." I mean, yeah, yeah, we'll, we'll he's see not he's that. not important enough for that. Yeah, I am now curious though what pace they choose for things here because if we go heist style, they can have theoretically the style where it's the they, we show them winning. But we uh -huh. don't know how they won until after. And then right, they do they're the... doing all of the stuff that is bringing, helping to bring about the win, but we don't know how they're winning, so we don't know that that's what's happening. Right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yep. So that'll be fun. So, mm -hmm. again, so I just almost want to set my own expectations in that the pacing after here could be astronomically slow or astronomically totally. fast. I, it really yep. depends on what style of heist story they go for from here, because this is effectively... This is effectively part two of the arc, you know. So, so the yeah. the thing that I've heard about high stories is that there's generally two different styles. There's mm -hmm. the we get the team and we all do our thing and we succeed in the heist and then you find out, you know, and then there's like a reveal of how it worked or, yeah. or something. Or versus there, there was a double blind or sure. something like that. Yeah. And then the other one is the something happens that makes it so we can't go with the original plan, but because everybody has their own unique skill, we figure out something else that then we can still make it work. Right. You know, despite Both of the them don't have pacing restrictions mm -hmm. necessarily, but there are a couple of ways in which uh, Kaiji as a show has slowed the pacing down dramatically all of a sudden, mm -hmm. and that's probably the weaker points of the show entirely. So the fact that the pacing has kept a relatively fast pace thus far feels like we could actually just get a fast pace arc all the way through. We totally could. But given that this is now the second phase if you will of this boss mm -hmm. and we're going yeah. in again right you could switch up the pacing again and i'm 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 wanting to just brace myself just in case although um, yeah. i could see i i could see it being just like another few episodes right sure it, and it it's really like could be you know yeah. and then and then we have something else after that that we get this season or something but probably i i would expect given the way that the op kind of shows um uh kaiji having Hyodo uh -huh. like proclaiming to a large group of people shows him running on the roulette. Yeah. Um, I, it feels uh, like spinning wheel means that there's going to be a point where Kaiji, uh, like goes past where he's at now. He goes into another yeah. game. Basically. Right. Because Hyodo could just be the metaphor of this is all his domain, right. you know, but, and thus this is the last game for, you know, you're right. The season, but, but I, we are still I at the totally halfway think we're point getting of the Kyodo. season. Yeah. Yeah. Uh -huh. yeah. We need yep. that. 
But y'all, thank you so much for watching this episode's reaction and discussion. If you want to see the next episode's reaction and discussion right now, though, go check out the link in the description below for our Patreon and get an early access there. You can watch full-length timer reactions there, and all this comes with Discord access, so you can chat with us in the community there about this show, about anime in general. And also be sure to check out my Baldur's Gate 3 Let's Play on Twitch. And if any of that interests you, we'll see you there. But until then, we're Semblance of Sanity. I'm Caleb. I'm Jacob. And we'll see you all next time.